Hi everybody and welcome back. So I just wanted to touch on real quick on the contradictions on the last video of getting started in your spiritual journey. And why would I mention mentors, not needing mentors, or about doing studies but not needing a book? Because for every lie, there is a truth, and for every truth, there are lies. We have laws of polarities and laws of duality. So there's always going to be a polar opposite energy or an opposing energy that is going to challenge that which is true or not true. So for example, when I say that there were certain mentors that don't need mentors, but every teacher knows that they are still a student and that they do have down low mentors, but not really having any mentors at all. What I meant by that is to just break it down in, in simplistic terms, um, as I thought I did. Um, some people came on this realm to be teachers. And although they are teachers, they still have to learn. So they learn from studying, whether it's online, from a book, you know, but a lot of it is from their inner knowing, their inner compass, when they're meditating and when they truly allow themselves to digest everything it is that they have read. They don't take everything that they read as absolute truth because they know that there is no absolute truth or absolute lie. There's always going to be a debate on those on any topic. And so they use their discernment without any outside influence um, on besides what they read what they read is what they're discerning upon but they are tapping into that discernment within themselves so this is a topic i kind of wanted to go in a little bit more later on just because that is a beginning video um but like i as stated there were some contradictions um why is studying important but also not studying and focusing too much on the books important because my main message in that last video was to get you to really connect with your energies first as i mentioned i mentioned the inner elements but we also do have outer elements and that is a future video that i kind of wanted to address and how to connect with the outer elements as well but the main focus on getting starting in your journey is going to be meditation your imagination you know tapping into all your senses tapping into your elements and also being open-minded enough to study things with an open mind that it may not be absolute truth being open-minded to debates being open-minded to contradictions okay that was my whole purpose of that video so i hope that this video was short sweet and simple enough to break it down for you to kind of grasp what it was that i was trying to say on the last video and again if you do have any questions comments or concerns leave that down in the comment box below. Peace y'all.